what's going on Theta Knights and all my Theta people and my Theta hodlers. Thank you so much for stopping by the Jolie channel. I hope you guys have been doing well in the crypto solar system. It's been a little bit dry and a little bit boring in the market, but we're definitely getting close. So um, I definitely have some gems and some good updates in today's update forecast video for Theta. And yeah, it's um, currently um, for Theta, we are at $4.32. It's in December 12th in Seoul, Korea today. Uh, going off my last video, I was saying five to 10 days, one to two weeks that we would find some type of bottom. And um, it looks like we did take a little bit of a dip and just a slight dip since the last video, like I was saying, right? So it was like a little, yeah, 7% dip. And now I believe we're holding uh, support. We're actually holding support on this downward celestial web line, a little bump and run pattern, we could say in classical TA, um, where it's just holding that line. Um, and from there, it's gonna start reversing, hopefully uh, by next week. So we have uh, in 12 hours currently, as this video is being recorded, uh, the weekly candle close, the weekly close for Theta and the crypto market is now uh, 12 hours. So let's see what happens. So ideally, we want Theta to close as high as possible. So I would love to see it either hold, at least hold support right here, right? At uh, four, anywhere from four, at that bottom of uh, December 11th at $4.25, $4.25, all the way up to $4.50. Of course, the higher the better. If we can get a candle close at $4.90 at this last candle on December 8th, 9th, that's even better. So um, other indicators to take a look at is uh, BTC Bitcoin to close up at $50,000 uh, would be a huge bullish sign if we can get it to close at $50,000. That would be amazing. Um, as time is moving forward something to look at if you're in the states i know in the west right in the us uh canada all of you guys you guys will be able to see that uh the weekly candle close i'll be joining you monday morning in seoul uh to see how it closes um but what else can i say um the crypto total market we want it to be at two 2.3 uh trillion that would be amazing uh, if we can get at 2.3 2.4 and of course, uh, we want the U.S. dollar. Right now, it's topping. It's it's now kind of oversold and topping for uh, the Dixie, the U.S. dollar index. So, um, as you guys may know, the more the dollar drops, the more crypto shoots up. Right? Uh, it's better for us. Right? Uh, for all crypto people, including data. So those are all things we need to take a look at. So please hang in there. I know it's frustrating. I got comments that. We're uh, expressing how frustrated and how disappointing and how stressful the market is. And it's only human nature. It's human uh, psychology, human behavior. When the price goes down, we start going into despair and disappointment and stress. It's just the way, way it is. You know, we're human. But we have to understand that there's a rhythm to this market, regardless if it's a bull or bear market or bear or bull market. What goes down must go up. And inversely, what goes up must go down. Regardless if it's a parabolic rise, regardless if it's just a relief rally or a bounce, those are some things that we need to keep in mind, right? So uh, definitely hang in there. Don't be too stressed. I do have some affirmations. I am affirmations, crypto affirmations to listen to, to really boost your mindset and your positive positivity. So and just to really hold the line right and control your emotions and to keep you from selling the bottom right we don't want you to sell the bottom and before it finally does make its way back up and before you know it you'll be regretting that you sold when it was at, at a just a local bottom right so but anyways guys uh let's see what happens you know i am uh, i think forecasting you know going off of my last video uh, that within uh, next week, which should be like 10 days since the last video um, or about, you know, um, one week since the last video, we should finally work our way back up, which will lead into the first scenario, which is the bullish scenario. Okay, so 
what will happen now if we are going in a bullish scenario? So what's going to happen is we'll finally reverse from here and finally finding that this kind of bottom and reversing and then from there we will be working our way back up from here by next week going into next weekend before Christmas and this could either like I was saying in the last video right it could just be a bounce or a relief rally and then pulling back um, so that's something for my traders my swing traders if that's something you want to play um, that's something to keep in mind right or for people who just want to see where the market is going so but anyways what could happen in this first scenario is it, it can finally work its way back up hitting uh, heavy resistance uh, which will be at the celestial web line a uh, celestial web line based on very peculiar symmetry um, this is acting as very heavy uh, resistance at around 570 so we can either hit that and pull back possibly right or uh, we can continue the rally this bounce going off going back to my next uh, celestial web line the next uh, heavy uh, resistance zone or this could be the next target if we break through okay right and then you know pulling back right or we can even go back to the last local high right in November or yeah in November which was about $8.56 around there and then pulling back right so that is uh, part of the bullish scenario so part of this bullish uh, bounce relief rally scenario which is you know similar to the last video is what if this is going to be the parabolic euphoric stage right there's max pain max fear in the market right now there's so much doubt and disbelief in the market not just the comments that I've been getting um, off of my videos but just people just personally that I know like family and friends who are just so upset with the crypto market and disappointed and angry and so stressed of you know why is the price dropping so much I can't believe that you know I'm gonna sell I'm gonna get out of the market I don't trust it to me these are all precursors of possibly who knows maybe it will go on a freaking tear towards the end of December you know finally reversing by next week slowly little by little the next two weeks next week within the next five days to one week and to continue this you know this uh, bullish scenario is having a freaking rip to the upside where it just it takes people by surprise so for example people who are in disbelief will be looking at this reverse in price and be like nah that no that's not it that's completely false it's not gonna work this is a fake out this is they're not gonna trust it they're not gonna believe believe this right and this is definitely a possibility I've seen this happen so many times too where people will be looking the price uh, rise up slowly little by little and then it won't be until let's say past Christmas end of December going into what I believe you know Q1 of 2022 being coinciding with what I've been saying uh, in all my videos of being uh, you know a parabolic kind of like the blow off top in the cycle right where it finally just goes on a tear right going back into all-time highs um, the last all-time highs was okay let me um, yeah going up to last all times all-time highs in Q1 of January uh, let's say January of course you know subscribe stay in tune to the channel for more uh, price uh, precise time and price uh, details but while the channel is small of course so I'm giving everything for free on the channel but anyway so going into Q1 we could probably blow rip to the upside who knows and this will take everybody by surprise where we finally rip to the upside and then everybody is just FOMOing trying to hop in and it's just human nature human psychology where we just get greedy right humans get greedy and we want to all hop in and what can happen from here is before you know it that this is the parabolic euphoric stage 
breaking all-time highs for Theta at $16 at that last wick. I believe that was in May or April. And then pulling back and then just ripping, right? So um, I'm going for, shoot, you know, anywhere from anywhere from 40 to, shit, 40 to like 70, 40 to 80, 80 dollars, right? Something, let's go, we'll go conservative for now, right? So definitely stay in touch with the channel, stay tuned uh, for, once again, for more precise time and price details, okay? So that is uh, the bullish scenario, guys, of what could happen, right? Whether it be a bounce or a relief rally or huge surprise where it's where a lot of people just think it's a fake out or uh, a bounce or a relief rally, but it goes just parabolic, right? And goes euphoric and everybody's hopping in, retail, whales, institutions, all are trying to hop in to uh, take advantage of the market. So those are my... Uh, uh, bullish scenarios right there so um, definitely stay tuned we need to stay sharp anything can happen guys so I want you guys to be prepared um, that's what I want to give on this channel is to really just prepare you for um, just different situations that can happen playing out the different probabilities and odds and situations and possibilities so anyways guys let me go ahead and give you the next scenario which I don't want to give but I should give it for um, just for training and education, which is the bear scenario because we never know what can happen, all right? So uh, just like my previous video for uh, Theta is that, you know, similar once we uh, reverse from the bottom here, once we really solidify that bottom and reverse uh, by, I, I believe, five to 10 days, five days to a week. Um, now for this video is that um, what could happen would be a great scenario is a huge bull trap, a huge trap that could happen. And this could be a twist off of the, the bounce, bullish bounce scenario where um, it, it just slowly creeps up by next week to end of December and kind of building confidence slowly, 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 doing something like this. And going back to that last local high, right, of $8.50, and kind of breaking it and so classic TA people will say hey we're making higher highs now and you know what I think it's a go it's a green light but we never know the market makers the people behind the scenes the big whales um, whoever they are will in this bear scenario will say hey we're gonna play a bull trap on everybody and you can hear my voice I, I it's so depressing to see this situation play out. We don't want to be teased like this. It's really sad, but um, but we need to stay sharp. So what could happen though, we could get a nasty little bull trap where suddenly it kind of pulls back and kind of consolidates at the top. Um, what is this in like Wyckoff distribution and or however you want to say it, and then taking a dip back down, right? and. For the bear scenario, it's not going to hold support, right? It'll look like we're holding support, but we're not holding support. We're just going to bounce off support at um, these support zones on my celestial web lines off of a very peculiar symmetry. And yeah, going back to the last local bottom, uh, $4.25. And we're going way back to the even last local uh that last bottom of 359, 358, and break going there and then kind of just drifting away. Right? So getting a relief for that rally on the uh, along the ride. So that is the bull the bearish scenario that I uh, predict happening if it does happen. And you know, regardless if it's a Regardless of it's a bull market or a bear market, you know, I'm always going to update uh, Even though I don't make videos all the time and I'm going to give tradable ideas while It's still um, while there is no um, Private membership. So definitely going to give uh, tradable ideas to earn along the way. So regardless if it's a bull or bear I'm going to help you guys uh, give you some ideas to make some money make some profits along the way so but for my hodlers who are just looking at um, the market momentum and direction, you know, definitely 
uh, it's going to be beneficial to uh, stay along and subscribe to the channel, right, to see uh, where it's going, right? But anyways, guys, definitely hang in there. It, you know, uh, this market is getting more and more difficult. It, it's not going to be easy, guys, right? Nothing in life is easy. That's just kind of the way it is, right? So we just have to be stronger and we have to be sharper. And that's what we're going to do, you know, help each other. Uh, stay tuned to the channel to to help you guys and yeah we will in the end we're gonna get to the promised land and yeah we're gonna get massive profits we're gonna get there guys all right we're gonna get there in the end we're gonna make some money um and it's gonna feel good so all right guys so definitely hang in there um have a wonderful day and definitely stay tuned uh for the next video for the next update i'm very curious to see where theta is heading with the crypto market but anyways have a lovely day an amazing day uh thank you so much and we'll catch you in the next one peace